How can they do that? Oh, so there is something you don't know. I can't believe they're tearing apart the forest. But they have to clear some space to make room for these new houses. That's terrible. What about the wildlife who live there now? Oh, I'm sure they'll find somewhere else to live. Plants and animals can't just find new homes that easily. They're not prepared for such sudden change. Oh, they're used to change. The seasons make the environment different throughout the year and they've adapted to deal with that. But this change is being made by humans and it happens way too quickly for animals to respond. Their homes have been destroyed, their food has been destroyed. So what will happen to them all? Well, they'll die. more and more of our woodlands to new homes, roads and motorways, new shops and factories and rubbish tips. Soon we might not have any forest left at all. When woodland habitats are destroyed, this is called deforestation. And it's not just wildlife that's affected by deforestation, it affects humans too. But I don't live in a tree house. Trees and plants play an important part in sustaining the ecosystem, which means the environment and all living things in it. Leaves are really important because they help us to breathe. When we breathe, our bodies need oxygen from the air. We breathe out carbon dioxide. Trees and other plants are so clever because they take in carbon dioxide and release oxygen. And then the cycle starts all over again. Without plants, there wouldn't be enough oxygen for us to breathe. And that's why we need to take care of our forests. <laughs>